<laughs> All right, go ahead, Chief. Good morning. This morning at 2.10 a.m. at Club Pure, which is behind me, located at 8206 Phillips Highway, Police Officer D.E. Holly Jr., along with two other officers and one police supervisor, were working off duty at this um, at Club Pure. As Officer Holly was moving some cones that are located near the front of the business, a gray Dodge Charger began to drive in an easterly direction through the parking lot. Keep in mind that there's about 150 to 200 patrons that are exiting the business at this time, getting in their vehicles and leaving. As that gray Dodge Charger begins to drive east through the parking lot, it initially drives slowly and then accelerates towards the police officer, striking a parked car and then hitting the officer, causing the officer to uh, almost be bent over the hood. As that car continued to accelerate, it pushed the officer away from the car. The officer actually sees an AK-47 in the passenger seat of the car. The Dodge Charger continues to drive away. Police officer Holly chases after the car on foot and discharges his service weapon two times at the suspect's vehicle. Both of the projectiles, one struck the back windshield, one struck the rear driver's side vent window by the, by the back door. The suspect continued to drive forward in an easterly direction through the parking lot, but had to stop because of all the congestion. There was a lot of cars that were uh, trying to get out of the parking lot at the same time. Other officers were working the secondary employment job, come up, they apprehended the suspect without further incident. Uh, police officer Holly, uh, this is his second officer involved shooting since he's been on with the agency. He's been on for 25 years and is actually scheduled to retire in 35 days. None of the other officers were hurt. Officer Holly sustained some minor injuries. I'd, I'd refer to them as being, you know, bumps and bruises type thing. The suspect was not injured at all. And I'll take any questions that you might have. When you said the officer was hit, was he hit while inside the vehicle or was he outside the vehicle? No, the officer was out by the front of the business, in front of, right near um, Club Pure. And he's, he's moving cones. There's actually four parking spaces that were coned off. So he's in the process of moving those cones away. He's outside of his vehicle. His vehicle's parked in the parking lot, but he's not near his vehicle. And so he's standing right by the cones. He's not protected by anything. Um, when the suspect's car strikes the one car and then goes into a police officer Holly. Do we know why this car, this man was speeding and acting this way? I, I don't have that information yet. Um, he's in our custody and he'll be brought down to the police memorial building where he'll be interviewed and uh, asked why he did what he did. Was the driver of the gray car uh, partying at your nightclub before this? I don't, I don't know that answer. And that's the charger right up front there? It is. We're at, I'm sorry, were any other, you said it had a car then? Yes, yes. The red one up there? Or? Yes. Uh, I noticed there was a parked officer car right outside of here and that had damage to its driver's side. Is there any word on how that happened? I don't know how that happened. I know it didn't happen from this incident, though. It did happen? Did not. It did not. Yeah, that, that's not, it, that car um, was part of our scene, but the damage to the car is not related to this. Did the suspect at all shoot, the officer at all fire No. Shots? No, and, and I can tell you, it, it, I saw the weapon myself. It's an AK-47 style, um, has a full, what appears to be a full magazine. It appears loaded to me. In the passenger? Yeah, in the passenger side, in, in, in the front seat of the passenger. And it's, it's, on the, it's resting on the uh, bottom part of the seat, and it's extending upward. And he took off, and then the officer shot after the car. Back yes, the car. yes. Um, what, if any, details can you tell us about the driver of the uh, Dodge Charger and also... Um, has it been established if he has a concealed carry license? Um, I don't have the, as far as a concealed weapons permit or anything like that, I don't have that information for you. Um, he's, I, I would describe him as a black male, approximately 29 years of age. Any other questions? And um, any other information that we may have will be released to the uh, police information officer once that becomes available. Any board members? I would say probably at least two hours, estimate. Again, around, around 200 people out here in this parking lot. At, at least, yes. And I'm sorry, around what time? Uh, 2 10 a.m. 2 10? Yes. And how long would you estimate like everything happened from the slow driving to clipping the car to hitting the officer? I would say, uh, again, an estimate. I, I would say within a minute. Wow. 
Okay, thank you. Okay. All right, thanks, Chief. All right, thank you. Happy New Year. Thank you.